Hi, my name is Aaron Bennett. I was in the United States Marine Corps from 2002 to 2006. My name is Sean Lundy. I did one term in the military. I enlisted in the Marine Corps in 1996, straight out of high school. My name is John Williams. I served in the United States Navy from January 1968 to January 1972. I served on the ammunition ship USS Sarabachi, AE-21. You know, some of the best memories I had when I was in the Marine Corps were basically um, the people I met. You know, I definitely learned a good work ethic, but most of all, just the memory and the friends and the brotherhood I got from serving in the Corps. I haven't seen a lot of these guys in probably 10 or 12 years, and honestly, they're still probably some of my best friends. If I call them up right now, I almost feel like we wouldn't have even skipped a beat, it wouldn't even seem like. I've basically been all over the world, and I've seen a lot of places and, and you know, had a lot of fun. You know, that discipline that the Marine Corps taught me, I brought into my career, and that's really helped me uh, with work life, uh, family life. I went into the Navy, grew up really fast, ended up being a school principal, and you know, I attribute my work ethic today to all my, my time spent in the Navy. Being in the military, it, it taught me to, you know, the hard values, and no matter what, you gotta keep driving forward. You know, at times it feels like we're always fighting evil, but believe it or not, in the long run, there is some good coming out of it. So. I love hunting, I love the outdoors. I especially love deer and turkey hunting. It's in my blood, uh, it always has been, always will be. You know, it's really hard to explain, but it's something that, that I'll, I'll never be able to, uh, to give up. We all know that, that one feeling when you, when you harvest your first animal or the first time you, you hear a, a buck snort wheeze or a, a bass flop out of the lily pads. It's that excitement that you know you felt to see that same excitement on someone new's face, whether it's a child or whether it's a grown up, no matter the age, there's nothing better than seeing a smile on their face. We are so blessed to live in this awesome country, United States. Most people take it completely for granted but we are so lucky and I just hope that uh, people realize how lucky they are to live in this great country.